Yo, what's going on world? Hope you're well today. Happy holidays to everybody. Hope you're ready for whatever's coming. If not, too late. It's on its way anyways. But I wanted to drop this quick video to let you guys know I'm Yo, what's going on world? Hope everyone is well today. I wanted to drop a quick video on showing you how to use a great affordable tool that you can use to text all of your clients. And if you do not know what I'm talking about, it is called text magic. Yes, I love this. It's cheap, like I said, and I'm cheap, so it works for me. And it helps you reach out to several people very quick for a very low price. Now, I will say this as a disclaimer, Texting has become a little uh, frowned upon and illegal in certain states. So please do your own due diligence. I don't need you coming back, leaving comments under this video, trying to harass me for something that you did. I told you, do some research first. But if everything is cool, then go ahead, use this, send out text magic, <laughs> send, out te send out text messages using text magic. And trust me, it will help elevate your business whether you're a little small business or you're a big business if you're a big business get your vas to do it and trust me they will love you for it i'm sure there's other services out there that work just as good if not better but this is what i found this is what i use so this is what i'm going to review for you cool that's bars that should be a rapper all right cool so what we're going to do is we're going to jump straight over there and take a look at the wonderful website now it's textmagic.com just in case you were wondering this is the screen that you get to once you set up your account one thing that i will advise you to do and you have no choice but to do anyway so it's really not me advising you to do it is to fund your account now i think the minimum is like ten dollars or twenty dollars or something like that and also they will automatically take money out of your account if you get too low i think it's below like five dollars or something they will refill your account with an additional 20 using whatever pay method you have uh, i think they take paypal or debit cards so please be advised you need some money in your account if you plan to do this especially if you're running a little low because they will take it without your permission now with that being said once you get your account set up and jumped on we'll come to this page as you see you have the compose the chat the contact schedule we'll talk about a few of these not all these because i don't use all of them i just use a few of them now, obviously, they're all, to me, self-explanatory. Hopefully, you look at it as well, the same way. But the first primary thing that we want to take a look at is the context, because this is how you're going to reach out to people. Who are you going to reach out to? Obviously, the context. Once you get here, you will import your list. Now, you can import your leads one by one or use an Excel spreadsheet to bring them in, and they'll give you a little, let me show you real quick, um, when you come here at a new contact, you do import from a spreadsheet. They even give you the option right here where they give you an example file of what it should look like, different options. So choose whatever works for you. Import your leads. They'll give you different fields so you can pick what you want to bring in, what you don't want to bring in from your source. And once you get everything all loaded up, looking all good and stuff, we'll come back over here to this page and boom, it will pop under this list right here show you how many contacts you have in that list and then what you want to do you can do one of two things you can either just click on the particular list that you you know have created and hit send sms or you can come back over here to compose now from this screen what you would want to do is i guess it's kind of backwards it might be better to do it from another screen but who cares you'll click on list you'll choose which list you want like i said it's pretty much the same thing boom say you'll choose that list You'll add it, bring it in here. You can choose what number you want to use. Um, you can, I, oh, that's another thing I should tell you about. They do charge you a monthly fee for a phone number. It's like $4 and some change. I can't remember exactly. Somewhere in that ballpark. Um, but you can have, I think, as many numbers as you want. I think there's a way that you can set up um, your own mobile number. But as you can see right here, it says it's not supported in my country. I'm in America. How dare you? Anyways cool so once you get your phone number and everything set up what you want to do is come down here and set up your message now this is the cool part because it helps you out a lot right here now 
You can use my message if you want. Um, you may want to change a little bit to fit you because after a while, they're going to be like, bro, I've seen this same message like a thousand times from a thousand different people. Are you guys using the same script? And of course you are because you got it from me. But no, you want to change a little bit to fit you, but I'll show you what I use. I'll be like, hey, hope you're well today. My name is Robert. I'm reaching out about your property at, now here's the cool thing. With text magic, you can insert different things. You can insert a template if you already have one set up. You can attach a file, like say if you had random pictures of their house and you're doing a one-off, you can send a picture with it, or you can send a contract or something like that through there, or you can do what I do and insert a tag. Now, remember, when you set up the list, they gave you a whole different options of different things you want to import and that you did not want to import, and those will show up over here. What you would do is you come down to the property and not do that because that was the wrong thing you'll just click on it and it will throw it in there for you boom reach out to you about your property at boom to see if you would consider selling now you like i said you can word it how you want i change it every now and then but this is the basic outline of what i use once you look at that Read over it. Make sure you didn't do any typos because you're about to send out a lot of messages. And it's not just going to mess up on one. It will mess up on all of them if you did. But everything looks good. Now, you can either come down here and you can schedule it to send it out later, which is cool. Especially if you're getting a whole bunch lined up. You might send out this one today. You might have one for tomorrow sometime. That way, you don't have to keep going through this process. You set it up, forget it. And once they come in, you know, oh, it must have dropped because my phone is blowing up which is exactly what you want. But okay, cool. You do that, then you hit preview message. When that shows up, it'll give you an idea of what it looks like. And like I said, the good thing is, it will show you the property over here or wherever. See what your message looks like. Shows you the name of who it's going to. Show you their phone number. And depending on how big your message is, they do charge you per message. As you saw, I think they should, um, give you like 300 characters per message. Um, and boom, show how many parts total cost of this one message would be 0.4 cents so 4 cents per message. This total session would be $225. I do not have that in my account, obviously right now. So it would not send that, but that's out of 5,630 leads. So for 5,600 leads, it will cost you 25, uh, I said 25, $225. That's not too bad to reach out to over 5,000 people. Boom, you'll come down here, you'll hit send message. I'm not going to do that right now because I've reached out to some of these people and some of them do not like that. Um, Yeah, boom. So that, I mean, that's the quick thing right there. And then you can always come, you know, check your history, you know, see what you sent out and everything like that. It'll show you the text messages, some of their responses and, you know, what they said. Um, Rejected. I tried to send a picture, did not work. I did a lot of talking with this particular person. Um, we're trying to set up a deal. I want to go see the property. They wanted a little too much for what the property was. It was in great condition. It just, anyways, I'm telling you way too much. But yeah, you could check a whole bunch of things like that, man. You can also do the lookup. They have different services that they offer. They can look up phone numbers for you. They can look up emails for you. A lot of different things that you may want to check out. I do not use any of this stuff. Um, maybe I should, but I do not. And it may be a good thing. Look, they can even send out surveys, forms. Like, that's dope. You may want to look into them. I do not know what any of that stuff costs because, once again, I do not use it. I do not want to lead you down the road. Um, some other quick things. What am I forgetting? Um, so when the people do text back in, let's check out what that looks like real quick. You will come to the chat section and, boom, if my computer moves a little faster, you will have a list of all the people right here. And then you'll have the message over here and the response like that. As you can see, I reached out. I was following up with the old list. Um, reached out to them out and they said it's sold. So whatever. Another good thing is, uh, you can also search cause as all these messages come in, you're going to get lost in the source real easy. So maybe you remember the address of a property or maybe you remember something from the text that they said, boom, come in here to the search bar, type it in, and then you can look up something. Trust me, it will save you a lot of time. What I do, if you send it out to a lot of people and everything starts coming in and you're like, yo, I know somebody said yes, but I just can't remember who. Come up here and search and I'll just type in yes. It brings up all the messages of people who said yes. Helps narrow things down. Um, 
I do want to show you. Let me see. Do, 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 do. Or the response is always the same. You know, for me, you always want to ask them that great question. A little nugget for you real quick. Tell them thank you if they say no, they're not selling the house. But you want to ask them, hey, keep me in mind if you have any other properties or if you do decide to sell this property. There's been a lot of times people will say no. But every now and then, you'll have that one person like, yes, I do have this property that I would consider selling, or they will follow back up with you. Nine times out of ten, they probably will not. But that's when you step in and you do the follow-up. You know, um, they can say stop, of course, like any other text messages, uh, text messaging service, and they will automatically take themselves out of the list, which is good because you can export that later and see who's on your do not contact list now. Add it back to your main file and have your list looking all clean to make sure you're not reaching out to people who do not want to be reached out to. Keep that in mind. Do not reach out to them if they say do not reach out to me. I told you about those fines. I am not paying them for you. Okay. Um, there was another thing I was going to say. Do, 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 do. Another little nugget. If they say, no, they're not selling the house or no, I'm not interested, that is not a no, don't ever contact me again. To me personally, if they do not use those explicit words like, hey, do not contact me or leave me alone or remove my name or stop because it will remove them automatically, then boom, I'm going to contact you again. No just means no, not right now. I'm going to follow up again. You're eventually going to sell. Um, as you can see, I told you I followed up with some people. I was late with some of my follow-ups, and the house already sold. That was on me. If I would have did what I was supposed to, I could have been the one to help sell this house or sold it or bought it, whatever the case may be. So make sure you stay on your follow-up game so you do not miss out on any opportunities. Okay, I think I'm making this video longer than it has to be. If you have any more questions, please leave them in the comments. I'll do what I can to help answer them. In the meantime, make sure you check out the book that I have posted somewhere. Um, I have a link down here, so you make sure you check it out. And if you don't know what book I'm talking about, it's right there, oh, oh, this side of the screen. It's so confusing. It's all over there, man. Make sure you check it out. It will show you step-by-step step how to go ahead and get your first deal done. I mean, it's basic. It even has text magic in there because I talk about it because I use it. It's very simple. I do not charge a lot for the book. I think it's like $8 or seven 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 because I love that number. Um, whatever the case may be, man, if you have any other questions, leave them in the comments because I will answer those for free. Um, if you made it this far in a video, that means that you probably have watched me before. You just like hearing me ramble because I do that a lot. But if not, um, I do want to bring up something real quick. A lot of people have been asking me about mentoring. I can't say a lot of people. I would say a few people because I don't know a lot of people. A few people have been asking me about mentoring. I will say, um, obviously, I don't want to charge. Um, because, you know, I like doing these videos. I like giving out the game for free because I learned it for free on YouTube and podcasts. But my time is not free and I cannot help everybody. So if you are very serious about trying to have a mentor and you want me to be that for whatever crazy reason, it would be more like an accountability coach because I'm going to make sure that you do what you're supposed to and show you the game. I mean, I'm going to tell you the same thing I'm giving you in the videos for free. I'm just going to be on your ass to make sure that you're doing it. That would be the only difference. But if that's something that you're interested in, reach out to me. I cannot take a lot of people on. Uh, I mean, like one or two, maybe. So reach out. We'll talk about it. We'll see if we're a good fit for each other, and then we'll set it up. Um, but it will cost you. I'll let you know now. And my time is not cheap. It's not like some of these other people that charge you thousands and thousands of dollars, but there will be a fee. But I will step with you step by step. I said step with you. Stay with you step by step until we get a deal closed. You know what I'm trying to say. Anyways, man, I rambled. You listen. Thank you. I hope you're welcomed. And until next time, man, if you found value in this video, please give it a thumbs up because it helps me out. The algorithm loves it when you give thumbs up. I probably should have said it at the beginning of the video. I'm messing up. Until next time, be easy. Peace.